Hello and welcome to my RuneScape 3 quest guide for Swept Away. There are no requirements for this quest, however I would recommend having activated the Draenor Village and Port Siren Lodestones. A guide for activating the Lodestones can be found by clicking on the card on screen now or in the description of this video. You need no items for this quest, and the rewards are 2 quest points, access to 10 portions of XP Goulash, and a broomstick. This is a novice quest which should take Spacebar Warriors no longer than 10 minutes to complete, and if you want to read the dialogue, it'll take about 20 minutes to complete. There are no enemies to defeat in this quest. To begin this quest, teleport to the Draenor Village Lodestone. From here, run west and speak with Maggie, and when prompted, choose the following dialogue options. The first option, ooh, something smells rather interesting. And then the first option again, is there any way I could help? You'll be presented with the quest overview screen. Choose Accept Quest. After this, when prompted, choose the first dialogue option. Sure, I can do that for you. After the dialogue, teleport to the Port Siren Lodestone. From here, run west following my path to Hetty's house in Remington. Once here, go inside and speak with Hetty, and when prompted, choose the second dialogue option, talk about swept away. After the dialogue, leave her house and open. After the dialogue, leave her house and open, and then go down the trap door south of her house. Down here, speak with Gus, and when prompted, choose the first dialogue option. It's a deal. Click on the box labelled Newts and Toads to take a creature from it. You will see some dialogue telling you what creature you pulled out. Click on the label in your inventory which corresponds to the creature that you pulled out and use that label on the Newts and Toads box. For example, I pulled out a Newt, so I placed the Newt label on the box. Now, place the other two labels on either of the boxes and then speak with Gus. If, like me, you didn't get the puzzle right, choose the second dialogue option. No, I think I can solve this. Then, right click on the two boxes that you put the last two labels on and choose Remove Label. Then swap the labels around and you will complete the puzzle. After the dialogue, take a newt from the newt crate and leave the basement. Speak with Hetty and when prompted, choose the second dialogue option. Talk about Swept Away. After the dialogue, she will give you some ointment. Use this on the broom in your inventory. Next, teleport to the Port Siren Lodestone again. From here, run north following my path to Betty's Magic Shop. Low level should be aware of a level 15 mugger that can be found around here that is aggressive to players below 30 combat level. Speak with Betty and when prompted choose the first dialogue option, talk to Betty about swept away. After the dialogue, climb down the trapdoor in her shop. Down here, speak with Lottie and when prompted, choose the second dialogue option. I need to retrieve Betty's wand. After the dialogue, you will have to complete a puzzle. This puzzle will require you to place animals into their correct cages. The order to do this is on screen now. 
First, take the blackbird from the blackbird pen and place it in the holding pen to the north. Next, take the rat from the spider pen and place it in the blackbird pen. After this, take the spider from the reptile pen and place it in the spider pen. Then, take the lizard from the rat pen and place it in the reptile pen. Next, take the rat out of the blackbird pen and place it in the rat pen. Finally, take the blackbird out of the holding pen and place it back in the blackbird pen. Once you have completed this, go back to the ladder that you came down and open the chest next to it. Once it's open, search the chest to receive Betty's wand. Climb up the ladder and speak with Betty, and when prompted, choose the first dialogue option, talk to Betty about Swept Away. Now teleport to the Draenor Village Lodestone. From here, run south to Aggie's house and enter it. Then, speak with Aggie and when prompted, choose the following dialogue options. The second option, talk about swept away. And then the first option, yes, I'm ready to go now. you will be teleported to a new area. Speak with Aggie, and after the dialogue you will need to sweep lines to create four triangles. One of the ways to do this is to sweep the following lines that I do. The northwesternmost line, then the two middle lines, and then finally the southeastern line. After this, speak with Aggie and choose the third dialogue option. I'd like to go back to Draenor, please. Once back in Draenor, run north and speak with Maggie. And when prompted, choose the following dialogue options. The first option, I have good news for you. And then the first option again, of course I could. After the dialogue, click on her cauldron to stir it with the broomstick. After this, speak with Maggie and when prompted, choose the first dialogue option. I've stirred the cauldron for you. After this, you will complete the quest. I hope this guide has helped you to complete this quest, and if it has, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like on this video to support me and the channel. Also, consider subscribing to keep up to date with the guides and any other content that I post. If you have any feedback on how I can make these videos better or easier to follow, please let me know in the comments of this video. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.